So hello adventurers and welcome to the club. Today I want to show you how to squeeze out a little flame out of an empty old lighter. First of all, let's switch on the backlight to show you it is empty. There's nothing in here anymore. By the way, a little lighter advice. You see this one here? It's black. Uh, guess what's bad about this? Yeah, you can't see how much is left in it. That's very bad. So, what you have to do is you take your lighter, either this or this, and you shake it down. Do this a while. And if it's cold outside, put it under your armpit or where it's warm. Then you fluff up some of your tinder. It's just a corner of a kitchen towel here. And make sure it's on maximum. You see? We have enough to start something else on fire. Another way you can <coughs> tweak one of those is this little lever here. It's usually all the way up when it's going to be empty. This one you see is even giving out some random flames again. But it's... See? Shaking helps. Shake it a bit and it's burning again. Yeah, this one here, let's go a bit further into it. I'm using my trusty screwdriver, which I have misplaced, so I have to ruin my fingernails. Oh my god, what should the lady say? What you want to do is, you want to remove this outer piece here. It's pretty simple, if you find your screwdriver, otherwise you waste a lot of video time. Just going in here, popping it open. You can do this in the wild, just bend it open, but it's a bit tight. You can use your knife. And here we go. Now we are directly into the lighters inner workings. This is a piezoelectric one but it works with everyone. If you press this down the little metal thing here and here makes contact and this gives a spark and you see having it open it immediately works a bit better but now we are doing something fun. This little ring we pop it a bit up go back on the other side and move it a bit more in the other direction you see Pop it up, go over it, and see, <laughs> yeah, this adjustment wheel does go farther, if you go too far you unscrew the screw and all the rest of the gas comes out, but we have now a lighter, put it back on, that is Good for another few fires. Huh? That's what I call a life hack. A life and death hack. Because this can be the difference between life and death. And even on this one, that looks completely empty, no liquid in it. If we happen to pop this open. Let's get you in focus so you see the money shot here. Trying to be careful because I want to reuse this one. Let's see. Doesn't get much flame out of it. Zoom, zoom, zoom. We pop this little lever up. We go in the other direction. Pop it back on. And go in the other direction. Up. 
on if we get it back on so and in the other direction and now we got a flame again oh by the way you can take out the piezo electric module here that's what gives it the spark interesting right Ugh. and you can use this little spark generator to ignite a paper tail paper tail but you have to use some liquid like hand sanitizer for example put a bit of hand sanitizer on this and then snap a couple of dozen times and whoof, it will burst in flames yeah so what we have seen now so far is you can actually get them back in a working order isn't that great that's real survival life hack and don't worry this will still work if we back insert this part here so be careful when disassembling them and keep in mind having a lighter is not only good for smokers if you have to light a lady a cigarette but it's also good to keep alive so hope you've enjoyed this video well you can join the club it's for free and leave a comment if you have some other lighter life hacks okay adventurers go out there have fun stay alive and have fun and now a little extra advice lighters are like girlfriends one is good two are better so always carry two lighters redundancy 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 you may drop one lose one one breaks so it's always better to carry two lighters than just have one but in case you should end up with just an empty lighter like this well maybe this little life hack helps you to keep alive that's what this kind of life hacks are made for